Tonight on GE True Hollywood Story, the band Life Size. No one could have predicted the success that the GE Healthcare band Life Size would achieve in such a short time. But the story behind the music reveals the rocky road they would travel leading to the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. The group was conceived as entertainment for the 2010 sales meeting. Six commercial team members were challenged to form a band, but they only had two months to do it. The players' diverse musical backgrounds complicated things, and there were widely different opinions on what to play. This made agreement on song selection a long and winding road. Out of the gates, things did not go smoothly. Practice space was crude, and at times so were the musicians. Their unique styles led to flared tempers, reaching the breaking point just weeks before their first show. The band was falling apart before getting started. During one of these flare-ups, the band received advice from some local officials who helped them find direction. Numerous TCONs and hundreds of emails later, the back orders were born. Their first concert was a smashing success. But would this be the band's only shot at stardom? After the follow-up performance, legendary producer Eric Roman rebranded the band as Life Size. This was well received with the fans, launching the band into a series of successful concert tours throughout the US and landing them an invitation to perform at the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. The group enjoyed success in the media, tabloids and merchandising. They even launched their own line of action figures, receiving accolades from several GE leaders. I think my favorite track in the whole wide world is I Want You To Want Me by the Life Sciences Band. <laughs> by now, the offers started rolling in, but the band needed a break. The long hours on the tour bus began to take a toll. They parted ways and took a hiatus working on solo careers and side projects. When we return, would Life Size be relegated to the annals of corporate band history? And now, a message from Life Size. When we left, Life Size had parted ways and their future was in doubt. When they were asked to come together to play at the prestigious and lavish Dipia concert, the magic quickly returned and their fans spoke loud and clear. It was time to bring Life Size back to life. Once again, they would come together and the group would somehow form a family. Here's the story. But that's a story for another time. The band's most recent single, Ready to Rock, is rapidly climbing the charts and has become the anthem for GE's Ready to Process global marketing campaign. The band has chosen Hollywood as the first, and potentially only, stop on their sold-out 2012 world tour. Not bad for a musically mismatched group of salespeople. I guess you might say that Life Size is moving on up. Well, we're moving on.